हेलो एंड वेलकम दिस इज हेना तलाटी एंड यू आर वाचिंग एट्स टुमारो न्यूज इराक वॉज येट अगेन कवर्ड इन अ थिक शेड ऑफ ऑरेंज ऑन संडे एज इट सफर्ड द लेटेस्ट इन अ सीरीज ऑफ डस्ट टॉम्स दैट हैव बिकम इंक्रीजिंगली कॉमन dozens were hospitalized with the respiratory problems in the center and the west of the country a thick layer of orange dust settled across the streets and vehicles seeping into the people's homes in the capital baghdad flights were grounded because of the poor visibility at the airport serving baghdad and the shite holy city of najaf with the phenomenon expected to continue into monday according to the weather service flights have been interrupted at the airports of baghdad and najaf due to the dust storm the spokesperson for the civil aviation authority said visibility was cited at less than 500 meters with the flights expected to resume once weather improves hospitals in the najaf received 63 people suffering from the respiratory problems as a result of the storm a health official said adding that the majority had left after receiving the appropriate treatment another 30 hospitalizations were reported in the mostly desert province of anabar in the west of the country iraq was hammered by the series of such storm in april grounding flights in baghdad najaf and arbil and leaving dozens hospitalized iraq's meteorological office previously said the weather phenomenon is expected to become increasingly frequent due to drought desertification and declining rainfalls experts have said this factor is certain to bring social and economic disaster in the war scarred country In November the World Bank warned that the Iraq could suffer a 20% drop in water resources by 2050 due to the climate change. In early April, Environment Ministry official had warned that Iraq could face 272 days of dust a year in coming decades according to the state news agency INA. The ministry said the weather phenomenon could be confronted by increasing vegetation cover and creating forests that act as windbreaks. The storms have become increasingly common in the Middle East with the experts blaming combination of the climate change and mismanagement of land and water. In some places in Iraq on Saturday visibility was limited to less than 500 meters. Iraq experienced a series of dust storms last month with dozens needing hospital treatment for respiratory problems. In 2016, the United Nations Environment Program predicted that Iraq could witness 300 dust events in a year by 2026. Iraq is particularly vulnerable to the climate change having already witnessed record low rainfall and high temperatures in recent years. That's all for now for more news updates stay tuned with us it's tomorrow news. For more global weather updates like this subscribe our channel and hit the bell icon for regular updates.